Okay, up next, the uh, San Diego Chargers uh, for... Uh, Excuse me, the L.A. Chargers. That's going to be I was just lot. agreeing with you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. For Vern Glenn and Jeremy Newby, I'm Dennis O'Donnell. We'll see you tonight at 1130. At one point, our son Dylan said, Dad, I'm scared. And of course, I said, yeah, me too. Dylan and his parents looked at hospitals around the country. They came to UCSF because the seizures were coming from a part of his brain that controls speech. If you're operating in this area, precision is everything. Up until recently, doctors have had very limited information about how specific areas of the brain actually work. But our new brain mapping technology is really pushing the limits of what's possible. This is enabling Dr. Chang's team to more safely treat epilepsy. And someday soon, it could give stroke patients who've lost the ability to speak the chance to communicate once again. That's what's so unique about UCSF. We have the privilege to treat the most complex cases like Dylan's, but also the opportunity to address what makes us all human. Amid a thousand maybes and a million no's, we believe in the profound and unstoppable power of yes. UCSF Health, redefining possible. It's just a cigarette butt. Just a little piece of trash. Just a slow leak of hundreds of dangerous chemicals into our environment. Oh, and known carcinogens. Okay, fine. It's toxic waste that can take up to 10 years to decompose. And it's just one of trillions. Who knew? Oh, right. The guys who made them. Customers know Tough Shed for storage buildings that blow away the competition. After 36 years and nearly 1 million buildings sold, now Tough Shed offers much more than great sheds. Complement your home with garages, studios, and other innovative models. All Tough Shed buildings come complete with professional installation and Tough Shed's legendary durability. For building ideas and free online quotes, visit us at toughshed.com or call us today at 1-800-BUY-TOUGH for the best deals on the best buildings. An all-new Wisdom of the Crowd, tonight at 8 on KPIX 5. Live from the CBS Bay Area studios, this is KPIX 5 News. Now at 5, a BART station stabber is on the run. Police cased the scene for hours as rescuers rushed bloodied victims to the hospital. And good evening, I'm Juliet Goodrich. And I'm Brian Hackney. One of the victims was rushed to a hospital after the attack at the Lafayette BART station. It happened shortly before 10 in the morning on a station platform. KPX 5's Katie Nielsen is live at the station with more on the search for the suspect. Katie? Brian, right now, everything is back to normal here at the Lafayette BART station. It reopened around 2 o'clock this afternoon, but right now, police are still searching for that suspect and also trying to figure out how this all started. Frustrated.